Patient's crashing. Oxygen is maxed out, but stats are dropping. We need answers now. We need the gold standard, the ABG. So what is an ABG? It's a vital snapshot of your blood's oxygen, carbon dioxide, and pH balance. It tells us exactly how well your lungs, heart, and kidneys are working together. Safety first. Perform Allen's test. Occlude both arteries, then release the ulnar. Watch that palm flush pink. That means safe collateral flow. Feel the pulse. Insert at 45 degrees. See that bright red flash? That's high pressure arterial blood, not dark venous blood. Cap it, remove bubbles, and ice it immediately. Heat fuels metabolism and ruins your data. Remember, time is tissue. Load the sample. In seconds, sensors analyze partial pressures and pH. Get ready, the essential data dump is coming. It's a balance scale. pH is the center. Lungs control CO2, the acid. Kidneys control bicarb, the base. Balance is survival. First, check the pH. 7.35 to 7.45 is the target. Lower, you're in acidosis. Higher, alkalosis. Where's the patient tipping? Next, PKO2, the respiratory acid. High means you're hypoventilating and trapping acid. Low means you're hyperventilating and blowing it off. Finally, bicarb, the metabolic base handled by the kidneys. High means you have extra base. Low means you're losing it. Case study. COPD exacerbation. CO2 is trapped in the lungs, dropping the pH. Bicarb hasn't moved yet. This is acute respiratory acidosis. With time, the body adapts. The kidneys hold onto bicarb to buffer that lung acid, aiming to normalize the pH. That is compensation. ABGs aren't just numbers. They reveal the physiologic cause. Subscribe to Bish Actor Live for more medical animation.